so this is going to be my first review of a series. I've done a couple of movie reviews and this time it's going to be for a series because last night I finished, finally finished watching The Boys. It took me a little bit. I was watching it an episode at a time here or there and so the final episode was up last night and that's it's done now and so I wanted to talk a little bit about my my perception of the show or you know how my enjoyment of the show what I thought about it stuff like that I'm gonna try to be quick but you know me I tend to ramble um, I did not realize until after I had done the reaction to the trailer that this show was based on a comic and so on Facebook when I was talking about it with some people um, they were telling me they, they, they felt like some one person was telling me that they felt like it was a bad adaptation of the comic and they listed different reasons why they felt that way which that's fine I mean if that's the material that, that you're familiar with and then you go into the show expecting it to be this particular way and it's not it can be a little disappointing right well I had no experience at all with the with the you know the pre-existing material so I go into this as a complete novice or you know I had just knew nothing and I really enjoyed the show I thought it was very well done the writing was strong the characters were believable now of course you know you have to suspend belief because you know they're superheroes they have these you know crazy preternatural powers but let's just you know whatever that's the universe they're living in so the characters were well written I feel like the dialogue was was done very well the acting was great and one thing that I was thinking about last night as I was watching it is watching the last episode I was thinking how that I really appreciated that none of these characters were really like one dimensional cookie cutter cardboard cutout type characters they were they had depth to them and they had good qualities and bad qualities about them even the bad guys had good like in other words they weren't your stereotypical bad guy you know they weren't there was depth to them that made them interesting like Homelander you know he you really start off disliking this this man with with a passion I mean he he's not that hasn't changed a whole lot but he became a more interesting character as the show went on you saw a side to him a sensitivity sort of to him a vulnerability to him that you weren't really shown in the beginning but there's stuff about the characters you don't know anyway you don't find out until the show is progressing so I found that I found that really interesting I like that also the fact that the people who were the good guys sometimes they did some pretty terrible things so they weren't even your you know your, your stereotypical hero good guy never does anything wrong they weren't like that either they were very interesting characters and the things that they did made sense there was not really a moment where I watched and I'm like man the writing was crappy in that scene or the writing was terrible in this episode that made no sense at all it wasn't logical blah 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 and none of, I didn't really have that experience when I was watching this so I really like this show and I'm looking forward to season two uh, now I had was under the impression that season two might come out like we wouldn't have to wait a whole year for season two and it does seem to be that that's the case but I want to say I think that the estimated time of release that was told to me by my brother the one who wrote the book that I gave to Carl Urban that's in a whole other video he said he was estimating something like March or April but I'm I'm seeing more like in the mid towards late summer before season two comes around now they are filming it they have been filming it for a little while so maybe 
maybe this information I'm hearing isn't quite accurate with regard to later in the summer type thing. Maybe it's actually going to be earlier in the year. Hope so. That would be great. But I would rather it not I would rather it not come here sooner if it's going to run the risk of the writing and the production and the acting suffering as a result. I don't think the acting will really suffer. I mean, these guys will bring their A game to it no matter what, but if the writing sucks because they were rushing to get this thing done so quickly, I don't know. However, if they've got material that they're that they're writing this on, like let's say the comics, I don't know how long the comics go. Are they done? I guess they're done. How much of the comics did season one cover? Or was or was there any like was there really no um, not much similarity at, similarity at all between the show and the comics? I don't know. Maybe you guys can fill me in because I'm clueless about that. But, you know, if they've got a wealth of material to draw upon, then they've, they've already really got the basics in place. They just need to write it for the screen, the small screen. So anyway, yeah, this was a, a very fun show. Uh, my husband even started to pay attention to it while I was watching it, which was kind of unusual. You know, he doesn't, we don't really have similar tastes in, in things like this, but he was, well, you know, he did, he did enjoy Deadwood and he did enjoy True Detective uh, season three. So, but anyway, we don't typically have similar tastes in things like this, but he was, he seemed to be interested in it as it was playing out on the screen and uh, got a, he got a kick out of the weird relationship between the girl, oh shoot, what's her name? Elizabeth Shue's character. I don't even remember her name now. Uh, that funky messed up relationship between her and Homelander, <laughs> he got a kick out of that. But anyway, so, oh, and Laser Baby was fun. I kept hearing about it and then it finally happened and it was like, okay, that's kind of funny. <laughs> In the panel, they were talking about the little baby, and uh, Carl was saying that, that the baby was really, um, what was it he said? How was how did he describe the baby? Like a calm, that the baby was very calm, like chill. And it seemed that way in, in, in the scenes that they shot. That baby was just going along for the ride and seemed to be enjoying just just hanging out, you know. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Anyway, that, that scene was funny. So, um, yeah. Okay, so yeah, that's a, a long way of uh, me saying that this show was fun. It's, a, it's, you know, a bit on the raw side. If you don't mind raw, if you don't mind violence, if you don't mind, you know, crass language, and you like comic book adaptation type things, superhero type, you know, I think you'll like this show if you haven't seen it yet, which I think a lot of people have already seen it. I guess, I don't know, I don't... I almost feel like I should come up with some sort of rating system on here, but I don't know. You know, I don't like to be pinned down to a number. I liked it. If I had to be pinned down to a number, maybe I'd be like, oh, it's an 8 out of 10 or 4 out of 5, whatever. But I typically only like to give number scores to things that I feel very strongly about as far as how much I dislike something. That's typically, oh, if I really super like a Terminator, it's a 5 out of 5. A 10, it's an 11 out of 10. <laughs> you know, that sort of thing. But, I don't know. In just general discussion, I don't necessarily like to try to pin a number on things. But, I liked it. It was good. And I am very much looking forward to Season 2. And hopefully there will be many more seasons to come. As long as the writing stays solid, I'll be very happy. So, anyway... I think that's it. I've rambled enough. I'm not going to keep on yammering because I really don't feel like I have anything more to add right now. I'm sure something will come to me after I stop recording. If if that happens, I'll put something in, in the description or put something in the video, some text. So what did you guys think of the show? Did you like it? Have you seen it yet? If not, do you plan on seeing it? Anyway, let me know what you think. We'll talk about it in the comments below. Bye.